Hey Denton, this is Jake Laughlin bringing you a brand new show here on DentonRadio.com called Discover Denton. For those of you that don't know, DentonRadio.com and the Convention and Visitors Bureau have kind of partnered up to start working on some projects together. We remain our own entity and so do they, but we kind of come together, share resources, put our heads together and we're able to work together under the same roof. So it's a pretty cool little undertaking. We're really, really excited about it. And when we put our heads together and just got crazy, we thought, you know what, let's put together a show that highlights some of the cool stuff happening around Denton. So once a week, this show is going to come to you highlighting some of the cool things that are happening around Denton. This week, we're going to talk about DentonRadio.com, of course. Uh, We're also going to talk about something very cool called Denton Radio on the Square. We're also going to mention the upcoming Horse Country Tour and the I Am Denton film contest so hold on to your seats first up we've got kim phillips vice president of the convention and visitors bureau denradio.com and the denton convention and visitors bureau neither one of us are new to the city but the partnership that we've recently established is new why have we established it for a very powerful reason and that is to take denton's message into the world with music For years and years, the Convention and Visitors Bureau has utilized the music scene as a tool to attract people to visit in our city. And that's our ultimate goal, to build tourism in Denton. The music scene is a real key to that. It always has been a real key to that. The the fact that what we have here is something unique over any other place. We have so many genres of music. It's not just one sound that happens in Denton. It's, It's basically... Just like our brand says, it's an original, independent movement. Whatever your sound is, you can find a place and an audience for it in Denton. That's where Denton Radio comes in. DentonRadio.com is the perfect vehicle to, to allow musicians to find audiences. And there's really three huge takeaways in this partnership. What our vision is, is to, number one, use the music scene to to attract attention to Denton, to increase tourism. Number two is for DentonRadio.com to to serve as this great vehicle for building audiences for the musicians. So it helps the musicians as well. It it, It gives them the ability and the platform to be discovered. In addition to that, as they're discovered, we have this huge live music scene going on here every single night of the week, well, it helps these musicians as they build audience to find venues that then will play them in order to attract their large audiences into those venues, which makes dramatically positive impact on the economy as a whole. So it's a great big circle and a great big partnership that's required to to plug everyone into the ball and get that snowball rolling. Um, so it's a really, really exciting thing. Uh, Jake and I were recently in Austin together on business and met with the Austin Convention and Visitors Bureau and learned that Austin and Denton are the only two cities in the entire state of Texas that are utilizing music as an integral part of the product of that community. And when I say product, I'm talking the character of that community. And that's what we're doing is pulling it all together using the the beauty of internet radio which has no geographical boundaries to be able to to tell the world about what we are to listen for themselves to hear for themselves who we who we are and what we're talking about when we when we talk about Denton's original independent style one final comment the partnership between dentonradio.com the convention and visitors bureau the denton county office of history and culture and the Denton Historical Commission. It's a a lot of mouthful of partnership, but what we're putting together in tandem with 35 Denton is Denton Radio on the Square. It's a first-time event, and event might be a little bit of a strong word because we really see 35 Denton as the event, but what we're going to do is man the living room. That's really what we're doing. We see the courthouse on the square as the heart of our community, the living room of our house, if you will. And our intention is to turn on the stereo in the living room so that as people come and go from 35 Denton, which they will, they'll visit the restaurants, they'll come out, take a break, maybe shop around in the stores. I mean, people like to move around and get a full experience of this place. And so 
um, our idea is that as they do this, they walk through our living room and they get to hear more of what's going on in Denton year round than, than just the big talent that's going on in 35 Denton. 35 Denton is great for us. It brings media attention from all over the world. And that's, that's huge. But they're big enough that what we're doing outside of the gate at this free stage is to showcase our local stuff that's going on here all the time to that international media. Because we want the media to walk away with the full flavor, the full experience, a complete understanding of who Denton is. The kind of musicians that, that will be coming to, to Denton during 35 Denton, they're big names. They have huge followings. We know that in years past, 35 Denton has attracted media from London, England's Guardian, from Australia, from south of the border in Mexico, from obviously New York and L.A. and Seattle and some of the key um, music meccas in the United States, obviously from local area also Dallas Fort Worth even Oklahoma City that pays close attention to what's going on in our music scene all this media attention is focused and our idea with Denton Radio and the Convention and Visitors Bureau is to really just kind of blow out of the water this new partnership that we have by putting a stage in the middle of our living room and offering all the other sounds all of the musicians that are up and coming and finding their audiences right here in Denton to showcase those to that international media while they're here. We're working in tandem with 35 Denton. 35 Denton, like I just said, they're really bringing in the really big names. But what's going on in Denton all the time is fostering new talent and giving them new audiences that that are the product of this whole music scene that's going on in Denton all the time. That was Kim Phillips, Vice President of the Convention and Visitors Bureau. I love Kim. She's awesome. All right, so if you're just joining us, you are listening to a brand new show on DentonRadio.com called Discover Denton, brought to you by the Convention and Visitors Bureau. DentonRadio.com has partnered up with the CVB, the Convention and Visitors Bureau. Uh, and, sorry, everybody always asks us to enunciate that better. Now, you just heard from Kim Phillips. Now we're about to hear from Dana Lodge about the upcoming Horse Country Tour. Well, hello, Denton Radio listeners. You may not be aware, but the North Texas region is one of the largest concentration of horse farms anywhere in the world. Yep, that's it. Right here in Denton County, we have over 350 real working horse ranches. And it is our honor to be able to bring those to you in a local tour that you can join us. We have the next tour is this Saturday, March 2nd. It departs at 9 a.m. from the Denton Historical Park. That's at the Bayless Selby Victorian Home on Mulberry and Carroll Boulevard. And we depart at 9 a.m. And we go and visit these absolutely gorgeous horse ranches. We get a behind-the-scenes tour and learn about what they do every day in the equine industry. We um, enjoy a fabulous chuck wagon lunch, and then we head off to the Diamond Tea Arena to see a little barrel racing before we head back. So in total, the trip takes from about 9 a.m. to 3. It comes with lunch. You get to see some of the most impressive horses and facilities anywhere in the world and learn about the horse industry and how these ranch ranches rock. Now, it's March 2nd, so we're right in the middle of foaling season. So you're pretty much guaranteed to see a baby that was born just the other night um, along your trip. So it's a really up-close and personal trip and um, just very, very much fun, lots of enjoyment and a way to kind of see the countryside. The tour costs $40 per person. You can um, purchase tickets by calling the Denton Convention and Visitors Bureau at 940-382-7895. And just tell them you're ready to sign up for the North Texas Horse Country. See you Saturday. And that was Dana Lodge up here at the CVB. And last but not least, we're going to go back to Kim Phillips to talk about the I Am Denton Film Contest. 
Last year was the first year that the Convention and Visitors Bureau sponsored I Am Denton, a video contest. And last year it ran completely within the Denton Independent School District with the um, videography, media arts students. This year we're doing something different. We are still having the DISD component of the I Am Denton contest, but we're also opening it up to the public. We had a lot of interest last year from the public and decided this year we're going to let everybody have the opportunity to tell their own story about what is Denton to them through our contest. And I wanted to bring this up because the contest is really cool. First of all, if you're interested, check out IamDenton.com and you can see all the contest rules there. There's some great prizes and a lot of really fun aspects of celebrating the winners of the contest, so check that out. But next week, when Denton Radio on the Square takes place um, with 35 Denton, is going to be a great opportunity if somebody was interested in telling their I Am Denton story through the musicians and the music scene, it's going to be right there for four days and four nights. You're going to have every genre, every type of musician, and a lot of crowds and movement and activity and just vibrancy beyond even the norm going on out there in the square. So if you're thinking about doing I Am Denton, that's going to be a great opportunity. Hope to see you on the square. There you have it. That was the very first episode of Discover Denton. Big thanks to Kim Phillips and Dana Lodge of the CVB. I'm Jake Laughlin, your host. Make sure you join us next week where we will be bringing you more highlights of our original and independent city. And in the meantime, go enjoy Denton. Denton.